Well, the DES director says the agency is holding up about a million dollars worth of unemployment claims because they suspect some of them may be fraud. And he also admits that some honest Arizonans are getting caught up in this mess. Carissa Planalp has more. We sat down with DES director Michael Weishart, who said even though many of you need your unemployment benefits right now, he can't just give taxpayer money to fraudsters. And he says there are many. That obviously um, on the surface is not an acceptable outcome. Michael Weishart, head of DES, says the numbers don't add up. His agency is sifting through nearly 3 million unemployment claims out of about three and a half million working Arizonans. While unemployment is very high, obviously that numerically doesn't make sense. Weisart says accounts flagged for possible fraud will be listed as in progress. What good does that do? Earlier this month, we two spoke weeks. to Royal Marks, who showed us nine weeks no, of claims in progress. Even after he sent a picture verifying his identity, weeks went by without any funds. Two days after our report, Royal got his money. Many Arizonans are not so lucky, claiming they wait hours on hold with DES without reaching an actual person who can help them. We, we continue to add uh, around 100 people um, every couple of weeks. Weishart says his team now handles more than 10,000 calls a day. Getting new hires trained and on the job, he says, takes time. Could we have done more? Uh, certainly uh, there could have been. Uh, more active recruitment. If your account appears to be on hold, Weisart's only advice was if DES asked you for more information to provide that as quickly as you can. Carissa Planel for Arizona's Family.